All right, guys, welcome back to the podcast. My name is Kenny and Ziska. Appreciate you tuning in. I've got a great episode lined up for you guys today. If you haven't been following me on social media, Facebook, Instagram, etc., I often do live videos. And what I wanted to do today is share the audio from one of those live videos with you today. I try to take the most popular videos that I've done, extract the audio, and and share it with you here on on the podcast so that you don't have to go around hunting uh, on, on Facebook to find these very raw and kind of off-the-cuff, uh, non-rehearsed, non-scripted episodes that I do. So I hope you guys enjoy these these episodes that I share with you guys. But before we get into today's episode, just have a very uh, quick reminder, actually a couple of reminders for you guys. Number one, if you haven't already done so, would appreciate it if you take the time to go over to iTunes, made it easy for you guys. Just go to kenyanzitska.com slash iTunes, take you right to the page where you can leave a review, leave a rating, uh, subscribe to the show. And also if you know of someone who would benefit from hearing the various uh, strategies, uh, mindset, the tools, whatever it may be, whatever we talk about here on the podcast, if you know someone who would benefit from, from listening to it, would appreciate it if you share it with them, would appreciate it if you got the word out about what we're talking about here. Uh, so secondly, uh, if you want to take these strategies and, and tools and really implement them and need the guidance and the accountability to do so, uh, we have a couple opportunities for you guys to do that. First is our mastermind. This is a tight-knit group of guys who are doing the work necessary to implement these various strategies that we talk about here on the podcast into their lives so that they can get the results, build the discipline, regain control over their time, and 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 live life on their terms. You can apply to be a part of our mastermind program, the Infinite Results Mastermind Program at kenyanzitska.com slash results. But if you want that one-on-one accountability, want to work with me on a very deep level and want customized solutions, don't want that cookie cutter uh, BS that that a lot of people are pushing these days, I encourage you to apply to be a part of, of my discipline coaching program. This is an elite program, exclusive program, very limited uh, with the number of clients that I take on with this program. So you can apply at kenyanziska.com slash discipline. So without any further ado, let's jump into today's episode. What's happening, everyone? Welcome back to my random ramblings on the road here on the way home from, from work. You know, things are just getting busier and busier every single day down at the ship. Getting a lot of good work done. Finding some, uh, find some areas that need some uh, much, much needed love and attention and, and tender loving care. But uh, so what I'm here to talk to you guys about today, what I wanted to chat with you guys about is making your own rules. And you know, I'm not going to claim complete originality on this one just uh, was inspired by uh, someone that I that I follow that I follow to uh, you know ironically follow and uh, you know one thing he was talking about is that uh, is that every single thing is up to interpretation including rules and before I get into the meat of what I want to talk about today just want to preface this by saying you know I'm not uh, speaking to you know the hard and fast laws and 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 you know things that uh, you know we're we're supposed to do to uh, keep an orderly orderly society for lack of a better descriptor coming to mind right now but what I want to talk to you guys about are kind of the kind of those unwritten rules that we have in our head that are passed down to us uh, from our parents uh, through whatever religion we follow uh, whatever um, I guess trade or um, schools of thought philosophies Wherever we get these unwritten rules, these these things that we have in our mind about the way things ought to be, and the way things should be, and that's that's what I'm talking about here, and and we have as human beings, we have the free will to make up those own those own types of rules, and, and like I said, you know, obviously we have laws and regulations that we have to follow, but some of the rules that uh that that we 
make up in our heads. And I'm trying to think of a quick example here, but some of you know some of the examples that we that we have are um, you know most people are taught that we ought to go to college, that we ought to uh, own our own home, we ought to have a mortgage, we ought to um, you know have the white picket fence, the you know all these these things that we're told that we should have, and. You know, who told us that we are supposed to have all these things? And another example might be breakfast being the most important part meal of the day. Or, you know, milk does the body good. The incredible edible egg. Like who's who made up these these rules, these these things that we live our lives by? And you know, we have to take a step back and look at the the places or the people that we get these that these that we get these rules from and not saying that anybody is necessarily right or wrong. It's what is right for you. What is right for Kenyon? What is right for Bubba Downs? What is right for whoever else might be catching this video right now? You know, what is right for you? What are the rules that work for you? And you know, there are certain people that we follow, certain people that allow, that we allow to influence us, but don't, don't follow those people, you know, don't follow what they are doing as complete gospel. Try out what they're doing, refine it, rewrite the rules to suit your particular situation. And we also have to keep in mind that that whoever is teaching us, you know, you're sitting here listening to me talk on this video right now, keep in mind that I'm only one perspective. And if you if you follow my word to the T, you know, you are not allowing yourself the uh, freedom to create and, and mold that to s suit your own particular situation. Everybody is different. Make your own rules. You know, re even, even religious type rules are subject to interpretation. You know, that's why we have extremists. They have an extreme interpretation of their, um, their religious views and there might be some very conservative views and, and you know and again these these are these are descriptors that I'm that I'm using and not everybody fits into that exact mold either so I guess the point I'm trying to make here is is just take a step back listen listen to what people are, are saying listen to kind of the the guidelines that people give you but don't take them as hard and fast make your own rules and, and that's the beauty of life, is that we get to decide how we want to live life. And sometimes we get wrapped around, we also, that causes us to get wrapped around the axle about what other people think about the way we interpret the, the morals and the, the, the foundation that, uh, that our upbringing gave us. And sometimes that, that goes against the fabric of who you are. And if you are that's that's one of the more most common places that I'm personally have been finding resistance within myself is that some of the things that I want to do you know I was raised Catholic and, and no offense mom my mom watches this uh this video but like you know there's you know I definitely have a, a religious belief but like you know I don't fit it I don't believe that I fit into a particular um you know Christian mold there's you know I like to have freedom to believe what I want to believe and and you know what at the at the end of the day I have three basic rules that I like to live by that's don't be a dick leave everybody the same leave everybody in every situation better than you found them and fulfill your own fulfill your own potential live your life to the highest level possible and I think if me personally that's that's how I live my life are they applicable to you I'd be curious to know let me know in the comments. Drop a comment. Let me know what you think about those. What are you, what are your basic rules that you live your life by? So um, you know, share your thoughts. Maybe you, you inspire somebody to revise their rules and come up with their own way of living. We can all. We certainly all can uh, trade trade ideas. We can influence each other. But at the end of the day, decide what you want. Decide how you want to live your life. And that's how you know you're gonna. When you make that decision, 
to that I'm going to live my life on my terms, you're going to feel like the weight of the world is lifted off of your shoulders. And, and stop living by other people's rules, by other people's standards. Come up with your own. So that's, that's where I'm going to leave it today, guys. Um, you know, if you're catching the replay or you're watching live, let me know that you watched it. You know, just say hi to me if you're watching live or, or give me a hashtag replay if you watch the uh, replay here. And, uh, and again, if you haven't heard, I'm, I'm launching a, uh, a uh, five-week discipline deep dive course. It starts April 1st. Um, have a couple people signed up already that I've been working with. One person I've been working with uh, since uh, the beginning of the month jumped on right away. Been making some uh, making some awesome awesome uh, progress, having some breakthroughs with him, and uh, want to do the same for for as many other people who want to jump on board. And uh, if you want to start working with me a little bit early, I'm gonna cut off uh, the you know the early bird little special that I'm running on Friday night at midnight to hop in early and. Uh, Get a little extra time, a little, a little extra value out of uh, out of your investment. But uh, if not, that's cool. You still can uh, hop in, even if you want to hop in late. Uh, that's cool too. I'll uh, I'll uh, I'll certainly welcome welcome everyone who wants to uh, hop on board, even for just a little bit. But if you want to sign up for that, we're going to be going over. Uh, we're going to be crafting a vision, crafting a custom set of routines and habits and systems for you to systematically attack your goals and systematically succeed at a high level. So if you're interested in that, go to kenyanzitska.com slash DDD and you know it's a simple enrollment uh, process um, and I look forward to seeing everybody in there. I'm really excited for it. It's my first time doing it. it might be my last time. You never know. Might uh, might switch things up if I do something like this again. But uh, Again, appreciate everyone watching, and uh, and if you know someone who uh, needs to hear this message, go ahead and share it with them. Um, like I said the other day, I think uh, I don't know if I don't know if, if uh, I'm getting ugly or something, but I think Facebook is uh, Facebook's really uh, changing up their algorithm, and uh, you know not getting the not getting the views that I that I used to. So I, w I would appreciate it if uh, you can drop a comment, drop a, drop a thumbs up, drop a you know, a heart or an angry face if, uh, if I'm pissing you off in, in any way, shape, or form. I love getting those. Uh, I, I could take uh, some negative uh, feedback as well. Sometimes that's uh, more useful than the positive stuff. Anyways, I'm going to leave it there, guys. Uh, got a couple errands I got to stop off here uh, on my way home, and uh, I'll catch you guys later.